Hey! Today, I'm kind of too lazy to just sit up. It's kind of been a tiring day, but it was a really fun tiring. Not like a boring, crap tiring. It was really tiring, because Butters was involved with a lot of it. She's a tiring dog. <laughs> I was going to take Butters to school today to have her ears looked at, because we were learning about ear stuff. So, she got to go on her first long car ride, which was fun for her. She got to look out the windows. It was fun. So I got to school, and as soon as I entered the building, she pooped. So that was fun. I got to clean that up, and then I had to set up her cage and her cage card and all this stuff. Today, in math class, okay, here's college math. I learned how to add, subtract, multiply, and divide. But yeah, and then I had lunch with Elida, and it was fun. We ate salads, which I actually haven't eaten a salad in a long time. And then I hung out with Hector because we have like a 10 minute period throughout the day that we can hang out. And he walked me to one of my classes. And then it was a speech class and we learned about crap that we learned about in Mrs. Nisley's speech class, which was a fun time. And I can't wait to relive this experience. Then I went to my... Clin path clinical pathology class, which is which was last semester, the one where we looked at poop all the time. This semester is not really going to do that, but it's still microscopes all the time. That's when I found out that apparently Butters had growled at my teacher when she was like around the cage because she's scared, and then she wasn't happy when my teacher was looking at her ears. So way to go, Butters, being the pain in the butt. But yeah, apparently they want me to keep bringing her back so she becomes more, like, used to it and we can kind of help her out that way. She's not nervous when she gets to the vet, though, which is weird. I think it's just because she was in a cage all day. So after school was completely not according to plan because I was supposed to pick up Sean from his lesson, which no one told me what time the lesson was. So I was just kind of waiting for him to call and be like, I'm done with my lesson. Ha ha. But that didn't happen. <laughs> and then I got a call from my mom, who was upset because my brother was still waiting at school. Because no one told me to go pick him up at that time. Then I got Butters, got Hector, we got in the car, because we were going to have a puppy party. And then we pick up Sean, drop him off at my house, and then we go and get Jake from Hector's house. And by the time we were like leaving with Jake, we realized it's pretty much sunset, and that's when the dog park closes, so we wandered off to another dog park. Right, not really a dog park. Another park in, like, the pitch blackness and windy coldness. It was fantastic. It was actually the same park that we at one point played basketball in the rain. <laughs> it was pouring rain, like, way summertime, and we decided we were going to play basketball. It was fun. And then we had a puppy party, and I have pictures. This one's of Butters and Jake in the car together because they love bugs. Can't wait to hear from you people. I'm going to be excited. I'm happy that we got some new peeps. I mean, I love everyone else. Love. But it's always fun to hear from even more. Even more loves being spread. Ah. So, bye-bye, love bugs. Ah.